channel so today i'm going to be teaching you how to take the perfect photo of your hamster when you want to take a photo so basically grab your hamster and a carrier or something like that <clears throat> then wait a few hours or minutes to just let your hamster settle in and do everything it wants to do and soon it'll eventually fall asleep it, you might want to turn all your lights on or in your bedroom or wherever you are with the hamster because that's when they go to sleep. They go to sleep with light because they're nocturnal. In the next video, I will also be doing a video on how to clean out your hamster. I'll do that on Friday because that's when we clean my hamster out. So I'll be doing that on Friday. I do post daily as well um, on hamster tips and everything that you need to know about getting a hamster. So I will tell you the video before of when I'm doing that videos. So if you're planning on getting a hamster but you don't have the money for a book, you can just click on my channel and it'll tell you everything you need to know about getting a hamster. If you don't even want to watch a video, I will put it in my bio in the caption. I'll put I'll tell you that I'm going to put it in my bio so that you don't have to watch a video you can just read it or you can watch a video which is much more fun than reading but yeah you might want to read if you want to so right now I'm getting my hamster out because she just wants to go out for a little bit so let your hamster be a bit more like sure, independent and stuff like that but first you might want to get like your hamster somewhere like in somewhere they enjoy and then you might want to close the top make sure they're not there though otherwise they can hurt them you have to make sure your hamster is safely inside don't try to shove them back in then you want to get your phone i'm just using my phone case because i'm filming on my phone then you put it somewhere it's got a hole on the top so just try and place it somewhere where the hamster is. You can put, put it like here. It doesn't have to be a hole. I don't recommend putting it on like designs that are on there. Just put it somewhere where there's no design and your hamster is. So that you can put your phone there and just have a cute video or a photo of your hamster like that. And also if you have a tablet, you can put it somewhere where it, the camera is. And you can always check over the top if it's okay and the photo looks fine um also i do recommend feeding your hamster before taking the photo because it's a lot cuter when they're eating something and it's so cute when they're just nibbling on it and everything so make sure maybe your hamsters eat has something to eat in there while it's waiting for you to take the photo and also maybe put a sippy cup in here my sippy cup my hamster say that he cup doesn't fit in here because mine's a bit bigger but if you could like afford maybe a smaller sippy cup um then you can maybe afford two sippy cups um like one for when it's in its hamster thing oh i moved the ring light and the second one for when it's in its carrier so maybe um do that also in the next video that i will be doing um after this video is what size do you need to get your hamster and what type of hamsters need to what type of cages so i'll be talking about those two things and then the third video that i do today will be about food and then i think i might be done i might also do another one on how to keep your hamster healthy and how to get the right hamster after this video so um and now i'm going to pretend i'm taking a photo of my hamster so my hamster is here so i'm going to put my here and i'm going to make sure the flash isn't on because it will just reflect off the glass and plastic then i'm going to take i'm going to pretend i took the photo so now you would look at your photo see if it's good and if it's not that good that, and you want to take another one you just put it back and then do what you want to do with it also, do not put the flash on. That will ham scare your hamster um, because a quick flash or a quick movement will really scare the hamster. So when you're opening this, don't do it like and just open it like so fast. Do it as slowly as possible. So if your hamster wants help, then you give them help. But if your hamster does not need help, then you might want to don't want to touch them so right now i'm just going to move the 
carry you, and I'm gonna move the camera so you can see my hamster just running around before. I'm gonna move it at different angles. Oh my goodness. Oh no. Oh my gosh. It's okay. The running light just fell. It's okay. Um, I know you guys can't see any light. I'm just gonna put my hamster here. No, don't go there. No, no. Okay, so that's it for today's video, and that all of that was in five minutes. So, if you'd rather re do this than read a book like I did, um, make sure to hit that subscribe button and the like button for more content.